Is, is there any way to find out um, whether the uh, person who assaulted me was a law enforcement officer or not? No, I, I wouldn't have that. <laughs> I'm gonna bust you upside your head, homie. Get your fucking head. Get your fucking phone off me, man. Get the fuck away from me, bro. Hey, bro, get the fuck away. Did you hear me? Yo, get the fuck get away. Get your phone me. off me. Bro, bro. Right, stop. How are you gonna just stop beat right somebody now. up like that, bro? Stop. I said stop. Stop. Fuck you. What you gonna do, bitch? I fuck you up, bro. Do it. Don't hit do the it, Celia. Do it. Do it. Oh, do it. Do it. Do it, bitch. Oh, wow. Oh. Oh. He, we have it on film. He just beat the shit out of us. He just beat us up. It's better. That's my MacBook. The same MacBook that was stolen off of my person in Venice Beach weeks earlier while the police were stalking us everywhere we went. However, at the time I had a very bad concussion and I didn't realize that they were trying to plant my own computer on me. And we're gonna, hey, we're gonna look at it when we verify yours and give it back. I'm telling you it's mine! We're not here to take this claim. We verify yours today. Sir, I'm telling you it's mine. Check these creeps out. Trying to see if I'll take the bait. Give me a little bit of space, okay? As soon as it became clear that the evidence planting wasn't working, a second group of cops who were wearing their body cameras came out to deal with everything. One of them, Officer Solorzano, is taking my statement. Can I get the cards of the officers that yeah, shoot the video too, please? Yeah, I'll get that. For you. That's really important to me. Phil, all right, so all I need right here is your seat, this bottom part, okay? I'll do the rest. Okay. This is just this is just so we can arrest him for you. Yeah, arresting person signature. Is this me? My name? Yeah, that's you. I yeah. didn't I didn't arrest him, he just beat the shit out of me. Well that's what signing the PPA PPA is. You're having him arrested. Oh, okay, alright, okay. That's what you want, correct? Yeah, all definitely. Right. My signature is uh, that you want to print my name or anything? Or? Your address? I'm I'm newly homeless. Uh okay. so should I, is it just NA or uh, I'll, I'll put my old address that, uh, uh, you know, I was evicted a couple weeks ago. Put your phone number on your data work. Yeah, okay. You guys know where he's going yet or no? And is there, where's that link I can upload this video to? Because it's really important to me that it... I'll meet it, you there and we'll, I'll give you all that, alright? Well, can't I do it right now? Because I'm worried that somebody can get into my phone and, and mess with it, you know? And, uh, you know... Send it I've you. had a lot of weird things happening. Yeah, if I could good? send it to you right now, that'd be great. You good, sir? Yeah, uh, yeah, I'm ready to go to the hospital. All I just right, need to send this officer the video first, yep. though. Because yeah, it's what? really important to me that I don't lose that video, you know? As my assailant is put in a squad car, I'm taken to the hospital in an ambulance. While I'm waiting to be treated, Officer Solorzano calls and threatens to arrest me. He said they were going to consider it mutual combat, so if I wanted to press charges, I'd have to go to jail too. I told him I had an overwhelming amount of evidence to the contrary, but that I was willing to be arrested as long as the dirty cop who beat me was arrested as well. And that's it. You started immediately started filming? Yeah, exactly. Okay. And after that, he tries to leave and then you follow him? Uh, well, yeah, because he starts running away, and, uh, 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 you know, and I just thought it was so, uh, incredibly I shady. I you were trying to get away, and, and then... Uh, well, I was, I, I got away to, to Hollywood Boulevard, and I started calling the police, and then he started making an exit after talking to somebody on a radio, and then so, he... hold on, let me get, just to clarify, so you, you tried to get away from him first, and then... 
So you went down the Hollywood Boulevard, or he went, or you chased him down the Hollywood Boulevard. I I left ex the the parking lot, and I went out to Hollywood Boulevard. And uh, uh, called out for my right friend, yeah, and told him that like you know this guy's just assaulting me and, and beating me up, and uh, and then we, we just started like started following him so that he couldn't get away and just you know <laughs> assault me and just kind of disappear. And so thank God we flagged you guys down and uh, we took him into custody. Yeah, I mean I, I I don't understand how he could say that is a mutual combat thing, especially because there was another witness by the way. I don't know if you know that part, the, but the store manager came out and saw him beating on me. Okay. So that's another thing that's, that's probably uh, worth that's mentioning. That's the storage place, right? Yeah. All right. Uh, well, you know. I'm, I, can I come pick it up in person? I'm currently a, a, a homeless, and uh, it, it would probably be easier if I could just come by the station. This is your uh, personal number, or? I'll give you a second. I'm going to give you a number to call to get the reports. Okay. Uh, are you ready for the number? Sure. 213. Okay. 486. Okay. 8130. 8130. And you are Officer... Uh... Solarzano. Okay. All right. Thank you, man. I appreciate you. And... Uh... All right. Uh, okay, so should I just come by the station, uh, whenever I can and... Call the number to get the report. Call the number and then, uh, I can, uh, make arrangements with them to get a copy of the report? Yes. Okay. Will do, sir. Thank you. The number he just gave me is to an automated voicemail for the LAPD's Records and Identifications Division. He's making me go through the red tape of sending a public records request, hoping that I'll just give up. In February, I mailed the records request following the ACLU's template, but still haven't received anything at all. In fact, they actually changed their policy as a department in violation of California law just to keep me from being able to obtain an arrest report that doesn't exist at all. Mail your request along with payment to the Los Angeles Police Department Records and Identification Division, Post Office Box 30158, Los Angeles, California 90030. Requests are processed in the order received. We regret to report that due to personnel shortages, we currently have a 20 to 22 week delay in responding to your request for reports. We apologize for any inconvenience this has caused you and appreciate your support and understanding. Additionally, LAPD is partnered with LexisNexis to provide a secure online web portal that will allow the public involved in a collision, their attorneys and insurance companies to obtain collision reports in a more timely manner. Good morning. How's it going? Uh, yeah, I just wanted a, uh, um, a copy of, uh, I guess it'd be like an incident report or whatever. Do you have incident number? No, I don't think I was given one. I was, I was assaulted. Uh, and uh, here, let me see if I have the... If it's the report, we usually don't uh, give copies of the report. Uh, you would have to get that LAPD down online. But... I'm trying to find... One second. Let's see if I can find the card that the officer gave me. They didn't give you a, a report on scene with an incident number, or did you, just you know give they you a did not card? actually, which is kind of weird. I was in an ambulance though afterwards, oh, okay. so maybe that's why. When was this? Do you remember? Oh, this is seventeenth. Okay, yeah, this is what I was given. Um, here, I don't know if that means anything to you, but let me see if I can pull that up for you. Okay. And this was in Hollywood? Yeah. <laughs> you have an ID? I do not, actually. I have a picture of my ID, if that's all cool. Okay. Yeah, I was going to... Uh, What's your uh, first name? David. Last name? And this happened on the 17th, correct? Yeah. Look at how swollen my fucking face is. He should absolutely be able to tell me the name of the person that assaulted me. The reason he doesn't have any information on the matter is because they never arrested him at all. Because they said he would be arrested and jailed. I mean, I have a video of the guy assaulting me no, and, uh, get my uh... fucking dog! Hello? 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 Hello?
Bro, stop fucking assaulting me right fucking now. Get your phone off me, homie. Then stop assaulting Get your phone off me, homie. Get the fuck away from me. Get it off me. Get the fuck away from me. Get out. No! Sir! I'm a mule kick you, homie. Get out of here. Bro, I just want my dog. That's it. Get out of here. I just want my dog. Get out of here. I just want my dog. Get out of here. I just want my dog. I told you, get the camera off of me. Yo, bro, I just want my dog. Stop you hitting me. Him. Yeah, for all that information, uh, just wait for the detective to be assigned. He'll give you a call and uh, give you all the information if he has any additional questions. Yeah, I have. Go ahead and contact I have, um, what is his name? It's Sor Zonzo. He's the one who took your report, your officer, correct? He's the one who's asking me for videos or whatever. Um, That's the, the person who took your report. Yeah. yeah. Hey, could I get the name of the guy who um, they arrested? Uh, like I said, you just have to go to the detective because I can't give that information out because I, I don't even have access to it. Um, okay. So if you want a copy of that report, yeah, I do. Um, you would have to go, like I said, on lap.online.org. Uh, okay. Uh, and request a copy. And then All just right. wait, wait on them. Uh, to uh, either mail, mail or a copy or email you a copy. Yeah. Yeah, so. But I can. Is is there any way to find out um, whether the uh, person who assaulted me was a law enforcement officer or not? No, I, I wouldn't have that information. <laughs> I can't even look at that. Uh -huh. um, okay. So like I said, I would just wait. Uh, I'll call the detective because he, he's going to do all the follow up questions. Uh, okay, so I should I should I call Solar Zonzo or? He's probably not working tonight, but. That person, that person is the person who took the report. So if you have any additional questions, it wouldn't be through him, it would be through the detective. Because he's gonna handle it. But there is no detective right handling it. Yet. It usually takes about a week or so. Um, but like I said, your best bet is just to either wait or you call back. And I can't even get you a detective today because they're usually back here uh, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Uh, it's usually Monday to Thursday. And it's not from like 6 to like 2.30 in the afternoon. Okay. Um, yeah, it, it's kind of hard on, on, on some, uh, when people come in on Sunday. One is to speak to a detective. Oh, yeah. I guess but it makes sense. As well, you or you can call ahead of time and let us know if you're coming that way. And then I can, like, schedule an appointment with the detective and, like, speak with them? Yeah. Okay. Um, but there's no way I can get the person who assaulted me his, like, name or anything? Uh, what house are you calling? Right now? Yeah, so here's my name. Um, when you come back, you can show them both business cards from where you came in. Okay. Uh, to speak to your detective. Um, like I said, it's, you're better off speaking to them because they have all the information. I can just pull up your report. You have to uh, request a copy on lapd.online.org. And on that report, it should have all, uh, pretty much what happened. They responded with a call. If they arrested somebody, they can be arrested. This person did it. Um, they, they said that they, they, they actually called me back and they said that uh, uh, while I was in the hospital and they said that... Uh, the guy evidently uh, said that I had hit him, which wasn't the case at all. And uh, uh, he had. Uh, um, they said that to jail him, it would be like a. Uh, I'd have to go to jail too, or something. It just sounds so shady and weird, but. Um, the the officer said that. Yeah, and I was telling him like, you know, I got the whole thing on video and. I, uh, any statements or anything okay. like that, that would be too detective. Exactly. Okay. Uh, yeah, because I, I can't even pull I understand. I yeah. Want. Okay. And then I, I had a couple other things I'd like to report too, um, if I can. Um, let's see. I'm just looking for a date real quick. Is it related? No. Well, maybe. <laughs> it's, uh, it's weird. It would be. No, this is a. Uh, um, uh, somebody uh, uh um get going into my storage unit when i'm not there so i just like to like fill out a report about that uh oh yeah so my wallet was stolen out of my storage unit uh november 12th
that? Really? So I have to call 911 and then have them send an officer out to the storage unit? Okay. I mean, it's beneficial in the long run. Okay. Because uh, they're able to take pictures of the, the crime scene and uh, okay. do the whole thing of print, the fingerprints and all that. Okay. Uh, that way, if there is a print on there, they're able to uh, pull it off and see if they can run it and get a print for that or a suspect for that. Yeah. Oh, okay. All right. And so. Then just try to like, get any information about the manager. That way they can contact him as well, see if they can get any videos for that one. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And, uh, you. Okay, so when they open up, I guess I'll just call 911 and then they'll. The non emergency line. The non emergency line. Yeah. Okay. All right. Sorry about that, man. Okay. Yeah, you take care, man. So I never got a copy of the police report. On December 13th, I went to the Office of the Inspector General to uh, file a complaint about the uh, police brutality and uh, evidence planting that occurred the month prior. And the same day they tried to, uh, just eight hours after leaving the office, they tried to plant evidence on me again. They repeatedly, uh, you know, stalk and harass me wherever I go. Yeah, I never got a copy of the police report because there was no police report to give me a copy of. Closures of the streets. If you dig my videos, be sure to like, share, and subscribe. Thank you. Have a good one. Um, they all know what the fuck's going on. Yeah. I said they all know.